Hey guys, welcome to the channel. My name is Dave. I'm here to help you build your own PC. So this is a Fantex 400A digital system that I built. And the video you're about to see is actually a snippet of a longer video of the complete build. So if you want to check that out, you can go to the link here. But for now, enjoy this little snippet for exactly what you're looking for. I hope you find it useful. If it is, do me a favor, hit that thumbs up and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you soon. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to install our CPU. Okay, the CPU in this case is the Ryzen 3950X. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the good stuff. It is 16 cores, 32 threads. Ta-da! There's the chip right up here. So real important when you are dealing with a CPU, don't ever touch the surface of this thing, okay? Don't put your fingers right on the front of it or the back of it, right? You wanna hold it very, very gingerly by the sides because the oils and the dirt and everything else on your skin will mess up the thermal conductivity. You don't want that, okay? You don't want that. You wanna keep it nice and clean and smooth. And later when we put on the thermal paste, it'll do everything that it's supposed to do without anything interfering with it, like grime from your fingers. So real important, don't touch the front, okay? So now, once we have this guy out, you can pry off the plastic, like so. And you see a bunch of pins here on the back. You can see that. Okay, all these gold pins, that's what's gonna go down on the actual motherboard. You wanna reach in here and grab it by the sides, okay? Just like that. You don't wanna touch the surface at all. Now on this, you have this little gold arrow on this side, right there. Okay, you see that? And whereas, whereas all the other ones are black. Okay, so there's this little arrow right here, okay, pointing in. And you want to make sure that that little arrow is lined up. But before you do that, you want to lift this little bar, okay? So you push it out just a little bit to release it from the tensioner. You want to make sure that that's up. All right, so here we go. We're going to install this guy right now. We can drop this guy in here. Make sure that's up. We drop this. You don't have to force it. Just make sure that the pins are kind of lined up you'll feel it drop in, okay? There, just like that. Nice little click. So you don't have to force it, you don't have to press it down. Now, all you gotta do is press this little guy down. It will give you some pressure, don't be afraid of that. And slip it around and let it click in. And there you go, now your CPU is installed. Ta-da!